Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Trainer of the year. Murphy Law is here. Move that out the way. <clears throat> you understand? We need to uh, get the schedule fixed. Oh, this schedule is... Hmm. I didn't know. I, tech, I, really, I don't know how I managed to get a world champion. I didn't know what I was doing here. You could tell I didn't know what I was doing. You could tell I didn't know what I was doing. This looks good. This looks good. What y'all think? Y'all don't know. Y'all don't know what y'all even looking at. That's the funny thing. <clears throat> All right. We got the days off. Right. Fatigue should be right. And then we're going to get the health up there. Make sure our fatigue goes down and make sure our bad health is right. Our bad health is actually pretty good. Are we going for undisputed? Is that the... Uh, we already a champ at 154. Oh, they got us. They're giving us a mandatory. Okay, no. No. <clears throat> All right. So, boom. We the champ at... We the champ at the OEBA and the WBA. <coughs> <coughs> we ain't the champ nowhere else. So... <coughs> <coughs> How are we going to be able to get undisputed? We're going to have to fight a couple of guys, man. We're going to have to figure out who's the man. Find out who's the man and whip his ass. EBU. Arjan. Ian Locke, junior middleweight. <clears throat> I like how they call it junior middleweight. Some people call it super welterweight. It's just as confusing as real life. Fernando Sola Vasquez. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Ian Locke. Ian Locke. Where's Ian Locke? Who is Ian Locke the champ of? seen that name <clears throat> in your lock he's the PABS champ we gonna get <clears throat> we're gonna get that do the title shot we gonna get <clears throat> damn he's nice yeah <clears throat> lock is nice boy yeah lock is already a champ well yeah Fernando Solar Vasquez, yeah, okay. <clears throat> I think I don't know. How old are we actually? I don't know how old we are. Let's see how old we are. Yeah. Alright, yeah. <clears throat> oh, we thirty two. Getting old, we're getting old, man. <clears throat> getting old, man. All right, so let's see. Let's see. What what are we going to do here? What are we going to do here? Are we going to give that dude a, uh, a title shot? That Ian Locke dude? <clears throat> oh, my God. Oh, he's W9. And, oh, okay. Well, no. This nigga. I don't know, son. This nigga look like he a problem. He look like he... Ian Locke look like he's a problem. Oh, this dude. We can get this dude a title shot. He's the uh, champ over there. <clears throat> number seven over here. And number... But... Fuck this. I don't give a fuck about the WBS. Nigga, I'm already ranked over there. That nigga's nice, son. Who that? Who's that? Craig Sullivan? Oh, okay. Yeah, whatever. Michael Perez. Oh, he's in the OEBA. He's number one. <clears throat> I 
Honestly, that's why I really want to fight this Michael Perez nigga, man. Fuck. And he's... Where is he? Oh, OEBA. Number, he's the number one contender. So, yeah, no. Nah. OEBA. Ain't none of y'all dudes in the IBS or WBO? Mm. Sitting here locked through, son. I'ma fight Craig Sullivan, son. I'ma I'm fight Craig Sullivan, dogs. You know what I'm saying? Cause they, <clears throat> I feel like they're trying to play me. I feel like they're trying to play me. Tokyo Stadium. You know, you know how it is, man. You, you, it's tough. It, it, it's difficult, dogs. It's difficult, man. You know what I'm saying? Doing these negotiations and stuff like that, it'd be difficult to try to get stuff done. But, you know, we got it done. And, and I'm, I'm just trying to do what I got to do to, you know, advance my career forward. We need, uh... <clears throat> Let's see, um, we need that fatigue. Okay, the fatigue is good. Life, we need life to go up, though. <clears throat> life gotta go up. Put life up. Need life up. My bad. Move that out the way for you. <clears throat> okay, hold on. Get some more proteins. It's difficult trying to figure this uh we already we obviously moved overseas when uh we're in America now so let's go over here Okay here we go. Oh 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 cheese tits Easy cheese tits. <laughs> How many days we got left? 81 days. Oh, this nigga is no boy. You're bugging out over here, dogs. You hear me, Playboy? <clears throat> Lose the weight. Lose the weight. Lose the weight. Lose the weight, fatty. Come on, fat boy. Yeah, we should. We're gonna make the weight. We got. We got. <clears throat> The only thing is the um <clears throat> the life. Not, our life ain't where we need it to be. Our neck ain't where we need it to be. Our abdomen is fucked up. Our arms is good. And chest and all that. Chest is smoked up. But uh, hand speed and all of that shit is good. We just can't get the life right. Hold on. 
We got to cut. <clears throat> we got to cut. We got to cut. Wait. Oh, he can't. He's not losing the weight at all. He ain't even been eating. So why are you not losing the weight, Playboy? What are you doing, bro? Oh, God. I'm trying, coach. I'm trying, coach. Coach. I'm trying. <clears throat> we about to lose our fucking title on the fucking scale, bro. We about to lose our fucking title on the scale. Yep. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Damn. I know, coach. I know. I know. I know. Shit is difficult, man. We miss weight. We fucking miss weight doing some goofy shit. <clears throat> doing some doofy shit. Damn, Orlando. Can't believe you, Orlando. That's fucked up, bro. That's fucked up, man. Damn, man. <clears throat> I still believe I'm training the year, man. I didn't. I said I'm training the year. I didn't say I'm nutritionist of the year. I don't want to see this shit. See if we can get this shit right. Good job, Craig. <clears throat> Orlando. Orlando not looking good at all. Orlando looking terrible. Is just, I can't get nothing off, bro's footwork is just impeccable. Well up, move back. I'm trying to nope. Trying to knock nope. Trying to knock my ass out. Trying to knock my ass out.
Knocked his mouthpiece out, stupid. <clears throat> I think he's whipping Orlando Chavez out. He was whipping Orlando Chavez's ass. Orlando Chavez, you getting your ass whipped, bro. Mm-hmm, bitch. Yep. Oh. We're going to go over some training. We're going to go over a little training. I'm saying you're going to have to, uh, you got to eat your proteins, man. You need you some steaks. Steaks and eggs, bro. Get you some steaks and eggs. Orlando Chavez about to get his ass knocked out too. <clears throat> Orlando getting his ass beat right now. Orlando, keep jabbing and keep circling. Orlando got his goddamn mouthpiece smacked out of goddamn jaw. Keep, you know what I'm saying? Keep jabbing, move your head, you know what I'm saying? Circle. Circle, man. Damn. Let's go. Keep using that jab and keep circling. Keep moving your head too. Cause you getting you getting your shit you getting your shit knocked off. He getting tired. Look at him, look, look, he breathing out of his mouth. He tired. He tired look, he tired. You know what I'm saying? This jab, this nice little jab. Work that body. Go to the head, go to the body. Move to the left, move to your left. Good job, good job, good job. What's up? Orlando! You alright? You good? Oh my goodness, Orlando. Orlando. I'm I don't know what to say, man. How did you become a champion? I know it's been a while since you've been into the gym, but I know I've been working on other guys. But you were a champion at at, at a tough weight class. How did how did that happen? They gifted they gifted you a belt? Look like they gifted you a belt. You got here an email champion. Oh boy, email champion. Good job, good, 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 good jab, good jabs. Keep moving. Oh, uh, straight right. You gotta eat your proteins. I don't know what I don't know what Orlando been doing. It's tough to not get to not get your ass knocked the fuck out the ring, man. It's difficult. Not everybody, and, and it's difficult depending on what weight class. I'm still trying to figure out. I, I got pretty much the the heavier weight classes from like 160 to 168 all the way on up to heavyweight. I got that down pat, but the lower weight classes like 
a, a junior middleweight on down, difficult. Difficult as fuck. Because I'm looking, look at Orlando Chavez. He a, 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 a champ at, at, at super welterweight. I'm telling you, bro, it's not, it's not, it's not easy. It's not easy. I'm still trying to figure out how this guy became a champion. I don't know how this happened. It's difficult. This ain't easy, man. This ain't fight night. You know what I'm saying? This ain't... <clears throat> Seen a lot of a lot of these games that you played. Knockout Kings. Ooh. That boy straight is difficult. Difficult to deal with. Move your head, move your head, move your feet. Oh God, Orlando! Get your gloves up, baby. Get your gloves up. You all right? As long as you can keep getting up, right? You got a big right hand. You got a big right hand or something? What do you have? What do you have? I don't know what you got. You got a big left. Look, you really ain't got no speed. I, you had hand speed until you got rocked. Yeah, keep working the body, man. And move your feet. Look, look at him circling this shit. Orlando! You was going to lose your belt anyway because you missed weight. I ain't going to lie to you. There was no way you was going to beat. There was no way you was going to beat, bro. Miss weight and, and be able to keep your title. You too busy eating Snickers and, and and all sorts of other shit, and thought that you was gonna make weight. You ain't make weight. I understand you trying to work on work on certain things, but it's tough. It's difficult, man. It, it, I don't want to yell at the guys in the gym, but sometimes I get upset. You understand? I get upset because. I'm doing everything that I can to make sure that you guys are in the best position to win championships and to be world champions and to make our gym look good. And then you guys are, uh, I feel like you guys are trying to sabotage that. You got Craig Sullivan. Craig Sullivan is a champion. He's not a world champion, but he's ranked in, I think, two different, uh, two different, uh, what you call it? Two different, um... Uh, what do you call him? Drink, whatever. You, you understand. You can count. He's ranked in two different places, and he's a, a champion nationally. So this guy is really good. But I, you know, I get you trying to do certain things. You trying to be undisputed, but uh, I don't know. You should just kept. You should have just kept trying to defend. You should have just did your mandatory, man. And then they, they go. You know what they gonna say? They gonna be like, oh, you know how boxing is. They gonna be like, oh, he ducked his mandatory. And then he tried to get a cherry pick, and the cherry pick went wrong. This Craig Sullivan is not a cherry pick. And if anybody think Craig Sullivan is a cherry pick, you don't know boxing. Craig Sullivan is a champion, and he's ranked in two different. Oh my goodness, look at that! In two different organizations. Sullivan, man, I don't know what to tell you, bro. That was like what a two-one-one. He got a lot of heart. I give him that. He'll keep getting up, but I don't feel like you laying any tracks. You you got him hurt. You got him up. You got him knocked down. Like you got heart, but what is heart going to get you? You just going to be getting your ass beat for twelve rounds. And you also got um your jaw broken. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. I got an idea. We should. Oh my god. Oh, he's done. Oh, he's done actually. If he gets, if he gets hit one more time, if he gets knocked down one more time, Orlando is over. 
All right, good job, good job, man. Sit down, have a seat, baby. Have a seat, baby. Sit down. What is good with the trainer, man? What the hell? Are we hired a new trainer too. Why is the trainer not training? Oh man. What we got? We got a plus what? Plus thirty percent. I can't, man. I can't, man. Plus seventy. Yeah, I get it. Man. <sighs> Show me some. Oh, uh, look, look! Right out the gate, you got hit with a left hook. Lee, left hook. Okay. Oh, okay. You boxing good? I'm not gonna lie, you doing some good boxing. Oh shit. Good job, good job. Getting your bearings back. Getting your bearings back. Getting your bearings back. Oh. Uh, yeah, it's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. If Orlando gets knocked down that again after this, it's over. He can get his ass and getting back up. Orlando, go all out, baby. Go all out, baby. Broke his hand. Go all out, Orlando. Go all out, Orlando. You losing your belt anyway. You lose it the right way. Lose it like a warrior. Lose it like a warrior, man. Oh, shit. Lose your belt like a warrior. Go out on your shield. Go out on your shield, baby. You never know. Go out on your shield. You may catch him. Oh, shit. Oh, no. He, I'm saying he's still up. He's still in it. 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 Oh shit. Body shots. His fucking feet movement is amazing. The power is amazing. I've always had a rule like, don't fight dudes with abs. But, you know, when you at this level, you ain't got no choice. It's like, do you want it? Do you want to be great or do you not want to be great? So. He's still hurting. He's still hurting. And our, our trainer's not. Our trainer's now giving him no, uh, no ice packets. Look, look at his face. He's in so so much distress. Orlando, don't worry, don't worry, man. We, I, I ain't gonna lie. Just give it all you got. That's all I can say, man. Just give it. Just give it everything you got, man. As long as you give it all you got, can't nobody say anything about you. You know, can't nobody take anything away from you, man. And you can say that you was a, 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 a world champion. You defended it a couple of times. We're going to look at the stats after this fight. And we actually need to, uh, I think we may um, actually go fight with a different character after this. Because Orlando, Orlando got a lot of work to do. And I, I really don't feel like going down this rabbit hole. Ooh. What's up, son? What up? Why you running? Why you running? Orlando figuring it out. Uh huh. Uh huh. Go ahead, Orlando. Show me something, Orlando. You in the stadium, baby? All these people want to see something, Orlando. Okay. My boy keep getting up though, I ain't gonna lie. Uh -oh. Oh. He good, his gloves was up! Ref, his gloves was up! Mm-hmm. You're gonna have to actually kill him. He's like Deontay Wilder. You're gonna have to drag him out of the ring. That's literally the only way you're gonna be able to beat Orlando Chavez. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. I think we got something figured out, Orlando. I want you to be... I want you to work on that leaf foot pressure. All right. I want you to turn them. I want you to work them angles. I want you to get them on the ropes and get them in the corner. Can you do that? If you could do that, I think we got something, baby. I think we got something, baby. You understand? It may be a little difficult, but you know I'm saying we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. Good job, spin, spin him, spin him. Leave foot pressure, so that way, because he won't keep going back and forth. So we're gonna keep every time he back up, we're gonna take an inch. Every time we he back up, we're gonna take an inch. We already been dropped, so. Uh huh. Boop, 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 boop. <clears throat> Damn, he went. He fought close. He fought him close with you. Get him on the ropes. Get him on the ropes. He may be even trying to rope and dope you, but it don't matter. It don't matter. You got it. Oh, you got it. Get that angle, man. Don't don't back up. Don't back up. Don't back up. Man, I step in. I step in right. Fucks you up. Good uppercut. You way too slow, man. Uppercut. Orlando, if you if you're able to pull this out, it's a miracle. In America, this shit would have been stopped, but you know, in Japan, they let shit rock. They think everything's a fucking anime. As long as you got the will to get up, you, you know what I'm saying you still may be able to pull out a win. You know, that that boy got brain damage. All right, you always gonna lose your belt anyway, cause you wanna eat too many Snickers in training camp. So, we got a new champion, Craig Sullivan. We got you a nice what? What's that? A Billy? I think you can retire with 1.5 billion. You know what I'm saying? You'd be alright. The gym, the gym got money. You got money. You'll be fine. I, Orlando got his ass knocked out. He got knocked down three times in the, uh, what was it, the eighth? Doctor saying that his shit is all broken up. He's like, your shit broken up. You're going to be uh, sidelined for about uh, five weeks. Five weeks ain't bad. I ain't gonna lie. For having my hands, for having Orlando's hands and jaw broken. So let's actually look at the, uh, let's look at the, the uh, rankings. Orlando is now five. The championship is vacant. Craig Sullivan didn't actually win the championship with that fight. I guess because I was overweight. Interesting. Um, no, no, I do not, but I have the, uh, Google translate. You have a, it's a, just download the Google app on your phone, right? And, uh, you can go to a tab. Let me see. Let me see if I can, uh, if I can walk you through it on my phone, go to your Google app, right? And, uh, you hit the little camera, which is next to your microphone. And it's going to have Google Lens. And all the way to the left is going to say Translate. So what you do is you'll put it up to the screen. And it'll detect whatever language is uh, on the screen. And it'll translate it to your language to English. Michael Perez. We ain't, we ain't even being looked at. 
I mean, we still ranked high in the WBS. I mean, I, w I want to fight W. I want to fight Michael Perez for the championship. Let's get out of here. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's save this and, and go on to another career. Let's go on to another another character. This, he's do he's all broken up. Look at him. My man's name. My man's nickname is the greatest. Damn, Orlando. Ten losses, baby. That's how you looking. Ten losses, terrible, man. I mean, it's not terrible. Oh, let's actually look at the um. Let's look at his career. Let's see. Let's see what you've done in your career. It's your bum ass. Get strong. All right, yeah. Let me show you. Oh yeah, so he was only a champion one time. All right, that's not bad. Oh he was, oh he was number one at, at light heavyweight too. Well yeah, you know that's how you that's how you actually get strong. In all honesty, is it is it's, if you if you want to know it's it's some cheating shit. You can you can honestly like uh, you can like cheat the system, right? Like watch watch this, right? So say say right now, um. I only got I got five weeks of not being able to fight, so I can kind of show you what you would do, right? Um, what I always do is do the easy setups because all of the going to like the meals and stuff like that, that shit is mad difficult. You know what I'm saying? Having to try to piece together a meal step by step, right? So I just do the shit the easiest way possible, right? Easy setup, right? So, if we want to get we want to get strength, right? Let's let's look at uh, let's look at our strength right now. Our power is at 300k, 345 and 325. So what I can do is I'm a middleweight because I'm um, I'm a little bit overweight right now. I can bulk up to a um, light heavyweight. Right, eat a lot of proteins and water, and work out all of these. Work out um, speed. Well, I'm gonna show you right now. Let's uh, you want to have a couple of rest days too, so that way it actually works. You want your power, speed, and stamina to be even, right? You want some amino. You want your amino acids to be high, right? Being that I'm in America, this is gonna be a lot cheaper because um. Hold on, am I in a, hold on, yeah, hold on, let me back, let me make sure, where am I living? Yeah, I'm an American, so it's, it's gonna be, uh, a lot cheaper for me to eat food than it is for you if you're living in Japan, right? So, you want your, uh, power, speed, stamina to be even, right? You wanna have high amino acids, now, mind you, this is going to be expensive if you're in Japan. You wanna have you some water? Maybe a little bit of, maybe a little bit of glucose, right? I'm showing you a, a kind of a rich man diet. Um, let's see. If you was, if you're on a tight budget, I would say like keep it around here. High amino, high kind of ni hao ni hao. <laughs> you speak, you speak Japanese. Get to um, get you some uh. Some amino, you want high amino acids, some glucose, and some water, and you want all your power, speed, and everything to be nice and even. You want to have a couple of days off, right? See, for me, that's only eighteen hundred dollars. I got three days off. Um, and look at my power. Is my power going up? Yeah. See, power starting to go up, and we're gaining weight too. Now. Um, I'm not really concerned about power right now, but that is how that would be how you can get power and it would be kind of cheap for you to do it Especially if you live in Japan your character is still living in Japan So as you see my power is going up 349 351 390 Right. All right. Um, I want my life to go up What's up? Oh, you want to see uh, the uh, the layout? This would be kind of cheap. Where's your cat? Is your character in Japan? 
if your character is in Japan, I don't know exactly how much this may cost. This may actually be kind of expensive. It may be like what? Um, $5,400. So that's kind of expensive, especially if you're on a budget and especially if you're in debt. Right? Um, damn, am I, am I about to get in the game anytime soon? Nope. Um, yeah, you, like I said, you want your uh, training to be nice and even, and you want to have uh, at least three days off rest, because rest and, rest and relaxation actually help your body, actually help your body, you know what I'm saying, maintain all the things that you've gained. But, like I'm saying, this is going to make you gain weight. I'm actually gaining weight at the current moment. That's pretty much it, yeah. But... You're, the problem is you're going to gain weight by doing this. So I don't know exactly what weight class you're trying to be in. So um, I'm going to have to come back down to um, 154. So I'm going to have to actually dial this back and um, have a little bit more speed and power into my diet. And that should probably, I think that should bring my weight back down. Hopefully, let's see. 32 years old so losing weight is is a little bit more difficult um should we go for the world title with british charles who the fuck is british charles who the fuck is british charles he's the interim champion from from monaco fuck that nigga um michael perez we can't fight michael perez Let's fight, dude. Um, um, passing is, I think, I think it depends on like the dollars. Hold on, let me see. Let me see what he's saying right now. Translate it for you. I think it just depends on the money. Get and passing has to do with like uh, how much money is the split at the end of it. And um, whether or not you go up in the rankings, if I can remember. Um, yeah, he's not saying anything about about that. He's what he's saying, and uh, all he's saying right now is about their record. Um, you know I'm saying. If you still win, it'll be easier to team up with higher ranked opponents in the next match. Okay. Okay. I don't I don't I, I, I don't think it really has a difference. I can't really remember. I always use GIF. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he did. We said what up. I always choose get. I don't I don't remember why. When I was watching somebody play, that's what they said get. They said use get instead of passing, so that's what I always do. Um Yeah, let's fight let's fight doggy. Let's fight you know what I'm saying let's fight the number one contender fight. We actually need to put it out for a couple of, for a while. Um we're gonna have it at. London? A uh, dude from Africa, so they don't got no. We doing it in, in Yokohama, man. We're gonna do it in Yokohama. Beautiful. Nihao, Nihao. And I gotta start losing weight. We actually we not losing weight at all. You know what it is? Oh. Let's put water, a little bit of glucose, and try to try to get that all the way up there, and try to um see if that we need that we need to start coming down and wait. Nope. The older you get, the harder it is for you to start losing weight, especially in America, because they're fucking the food is terrible. Food is horrible. Hari All right, that should work. There we go. Let 
Here we go. If you ever wanna, if you ever in a pinch and you need to lose weight, speed is the surefire way to do go. I don't know why I couldn't get that sentence out. Speed is the surefire way to go. You, the more you work on speed and the less you eat, pounds will just shred off. But a lot of your your stats are gonna start shredding off too because you're not getting the sufficient proteins and stuff that you will need. So, I mean, we're, we're having a decent amount of uh, stats stay. Our our life was at like 200k, and we still we still have a lot of pounds to lose though. We have a lot of pounds to lose. Got to box smart too, man. You can't you can't be in the pocket and, and just throw hands. You also got to move around and box and, and create angles. If you just stand there and just wing shots, try to go blow for blow, man, that shit is gonna lead to danger. This dude is not losing the weight like I need him to. I know his bad health is gonna be through the roof by doing this, but you need I need the I need the pounds to come off, bro. Need the pounds to come off, bro. Sorry. Coach, I'm trying everything, bro. I know he's way overweight by now, but I'm trying. We got 60 days. So, bro. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna make it, bro. I don't want to cut his water supply, but All right, we he ain't gonna make it, bro. It's tough, man. This is a tough weight cut. Where's my power at? My power is going down. My power is still kind of decent, but it's not as good as it was. My shit was at 380, was at 390 at heavy power and, uh, what, 350 for solid power? Power, the, the shit is. Ay, ay, ay. It's not coming off, man. This is gonna kill him. I'm not gonna lie. Having having this much uh, training is gonna kill a guy. But I we need you to. Uh... Your life, and um, yeah, your life. In all honesty, I can show you another character that's uh that's really good. But he's a heavyweight, so it doesn't really matter what he eats. What weight class? I need to know a couple of things too. I need to know where you're living. I need to know what weight class you're in. I need to know um, uh, how old you are. We can probably set up a little bit of uh, a little bit of things that that you would need to focus on, and uh, your bad health and your fatigue also also have a factor in um in uh your ability to take a punch as well so if you're working out too much and you're not getting the right foods and stuff like that and your fatigue is really high you get a punch you get the minute you get punched you get dropped so a lot of a lot of factors are uh, get taken into account man we're not gonna make weight coach we're not gonna make weight bro i'm i'm, I'm sorry it should have been at a catch weight or something So you're Japanese welterweight. All right, so if you want to stay at 147, that's going to be, let's see, do we have a, a 147 pounder? That shit is going to be expense, expensive too. Yeah, how far um, how far are you in your career? Are you in debt or anything? Are you ranked? Go to a different character. Because a lot of this, uh, a lot of that has to, uh, has to factor in too. <laughs> okay, so it's your, is it your first, this is your first time hopping into the game? 
I don't know. I don't. All right, let me let me be let me be totally honest with you. I know maybe a little bit more than you do, but I also don't really know shit. So I'm not the the, the leading expert in Boxers Road. Okay, all right. I'm not the leading expert in Boxers Road, but I do know a little bit of shit. So as you can see, I have Orlando was a world champion, so we had one world champion. Um, yeah, absolutely. We'll we'll make him we'll make him Gary. Lil Gary. Uh let's see. Uh we had him. I think he was a world champion as well. Lucky world champion. Blood, not a world champion yet. A B not yet. Pierce Morgan, world champion. So we had a we had a couple dudes coming to the stable that was actually really good. And then a couple of dudes that I was working on. I'm trying to work on the super featherweight dudes. So let's back out. Let's make one. Make a dude at 147. And um, I'm going to show you a couple of secrets that could actually help you with um, with uh, with uh, getting your dude really, really strong at first. And then getting to your desired weight class. Um, first, you want to make him as small as possible. That's step one, right? Yes, yes, coach. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> uh, what? So, what's your? What will be your desired weight class? Let's see. What's what's your nickname? And coming into the ring, any weight class is a good one. Okay. Well, all right. I'm gonna show you. All right. If that's the case, then I'm gonna show you the secret, and then from there you can take that secret, and then you can tailor it to your next boxes, and then you can go and and open your own get open your own gym. All right, Lil Gary, stepping into the ring. Lil Gary. All right. Oh shit! See, fucking the, the fucking buttons are stupid. Buttons are fucking dumb because you have to. I'm so used to fucking uh B being. Not B, fucking uh, A, B, and select. And then B, they have it flipped. It's basically flipped. So sometimes the shit give me fucking, uh, shit give me fucking twisted upside down. All right. We want to make you as young as possible. All right. All right. Well, when's your birthday? When, when's your birthday? Uh, we're going to give you, I don't know if you know your, your blood type. I think actually, I'm not going to lie to you. I think where you're born, I think your blood type, I think all of that shit matters. So I'm still actually tinkering with stuff like that. So that's the shit that, that that's kind of like fucking me up because I'm like, hmm, does this matter? Does this not matter? It, it kind of feel like it does because like certain people could eat certain things that certain other people can't eat. Let's let's make you uh, let's make you a right? let's make you a positive. No, yeah, that's gonna make you A. Alright. Let's make you um we wanna make you as little as possible. You wanna be a little skinny guy, cause you're young, still growing up. I'm gonna make you type tall. Uh 170 what? What seventy eight? I don't know what that is. I, I can I can never remember what that is and uh and oh actually let's make you let's make you like Let's make you like one one seventy nine five, right? That's pretty tall, right? I'm going to have a long, long wingspan. Do you want the uh, what type of uh, guard you want to have? You want to have the Philly shell? You want to have a high guard? You want to have a traditional guard? You want to have your hands low? You want to be stylish? We can come back to that. Uh, let's see. Switch stance. Nah, nah, that shit really matters. I think this is switch. I can't really remember, but it doesn't. Like I said, none of this shit really matters. If you really, if you really good, you can box. However, in all honesty, Hitman. Okay, yeah, everybody want the Hitman. Everybody want the Hitman. Oh, you start. They start you off in lightweight. Yeah, you kind of. So you must be. You must be tall as shit. 
Let's actually go back because I don't, I don't want you. I don't want you to start in uh, start in lightweight. Um. That should be good. That should be good. Still not lightweight though. There we go. There you go. Little tiny guy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Where you from? You gonna be from? Or should we just do random? Let's do random. Oh, that's the wrong one. Let's do random. Uh, let's see. You black? All right, I'm black too. All right. Let's see. I would give... You know what? We got an African world... Oh, that's, that's not Africa. <laughs> Oh, uh, let's see. Let me give you a smooth brother. No, I'm going to give you an American brother. I'm going to give you an American brother. I ain't going to do you dirty. I ain't going to do you greasy. I ain't going to do you filthy. It's tough to find a, a brother in a, in America, though. They do us feel... Oh! I got to go slow. Hold on. You got to go slow. They got the afro. Okay, okay. Let's see if we can go a little bit faster. Alright, let's see. What, what, let's see. East Coast. Uh, yeah, we can work with we can work with homeboy. We can work with homeboy. I just changed his complexion and shit. Yeah, for the gods and the earths. Nice melanated brother. That man look crazy. Hey guys, like a little bit more complexion, a little bit more of the reds. There you go. Uh, let's see. Your hair's looking bananas. I ain't gonna lie. I can't do. I can't do the hair. I'm gonna give you the 360s. Where the 360s at? We're gonna be. We're gonna make you wild smooth. We're gonna be a smooth dude. Damn, I can't. I can't even find the uh, the right heads. Oh, we could give you the, the comb over. Give you a comb over quaff. Oh, there you go. You go. You got the fake 360s on you. All right. See you. No shape up. All right. All right. Got you. I got you. Get your little little peach fuzz on your face. Uh, box of fighter. Don't you want hit man? Um, yeah, we can do something different. We can do something different. Or if you want hit me, you let me know. We high on you. We high on you. So we're gonna get you some nice trunks. We're gonna get you out them out them garbage trunks. You know I'm saying we think really highly of you coming into the gym. So don't let us down when we put these when we put these good trunks on you, man. Mmm. Mmm. Right, I ain't feeling the dress shit though. I don't do that. I don't do the skirts and the dresses like that though. So I'm not gonna lie to you. It's cool, you know what I'm saying? For Hector Camacho, not for me. Me personally, you know, I would like, you know, something normal. Uh, this is nice to customize them. Give you a little 
your soul, man. Give your little soul, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Punch direction is um, basically you don't have the sway mechanic, right? So instead, you would just um, you would just use the um, the uh, the button that you would use the sway to punch to the head or to the body. So you would basically uh, it would be like a punch modifier instead of uh, a sway feature. So you got sway, you got block, and then you got punch direction. Punch direction, you ain't really got no block besides your normal block, so I wouldn't really, I wouldn't really, you know. I always pick sway. Sway is, is usually the best because you really want head movement. Fighter, you want to go fighter, boxer, fighter, hitman, decide it. He's a woodoo guy. What's 161 centimeters? I, I've got to know because I feel like that's kind of short. Yeah, I think a 5 2. Make you at least, make you at least 5 10. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. That's still five six. Still ain't really that tall. Or <laughs> to me, that's still still type short. Make you 182. At least, at least, at least be a little bit taller than Tank Davis. Like, like respect yourself. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to be, you don't want to be shorter than Tank Davis. Like, come on, dogs. Like, have some respect for yourself. I haven't really actually made a, a boxer this tall, so this actually may give you an advantage, in all honesty. I've always made my guys widow guys. And in turn, you know, you can't really... Some, it's some dudes that, that literally kept me on the outside and jabbed the fuck out of me, so... 179 would be... 5'8". That's not bad. That ain't bad. Five eight ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. All right, I think we got him. I think we got the kid, little Gary, coming into the gym, coming in the mediocre, mediocre boxing gym. All right, let's see how you. Let's see how your career fares. We're gonna teach you a couple tricks of the trade. We're gonna show you a couple things. You're gonna be a beast. Trust me. Watch. Watch this. Watch what I show you. It is kind of cheating, but still, you know. You gotta figure out. You gotta figure out certain things on how to, you know, 
bring your shit back. We got Lil Gary, but not Russell. My boy Gary Antonio Russell got his ass whipped. That shit was bad. Was it? No, I think that was Gary Anton Russell. But he got yo. What's going on? Oh, this shit crashed. Gary, what's going on, bro? Bro, you, you crashed the game, dogs? Like, I've never seen this before. I've never seen this, Gary. What happened? Wow. I've never seen this. <laughs> wow. All right, let's... um. Uh, let's just restart it. Let's just restart it. Damn, that's crazy. Don't worry, we're gonna we're gonna get it back open. Um, all right. Yep, yep, yep. Jeez Louises. Um Yeah, and I didn't of course I didn't save it. We made you A, made you 179. Oh, that's dumb tall. Make you as light as possible. Can't remember which is whatever. Maybe we make you a brother. Oh, damn. This nigga look crazy. <laughs> look like Drake's father. Why all these dudes look crazy, though? Here we go. That's a nice template. That's a nice template. Get your clothing ray. I forgot what trunks you had. I don't know. It was something about that character. He probably had bad juju or something. It wasn't meant to be, man. 
It probably was not meant to be. Um, <laughs> and he's born in, and he's born in fucking, uh, and he's born in, uh, fucking Japan. That's definitely bad juju, man. Something ain't right. Something ain't right, man. Super featherweight. We couldn't make him no shorter, no, no lighter than that. All right, that's fine. Whatever, that's fine. All right, yep. There we go. <laughs> Little Gary, no Russell. You know, coaches gonna want to know your other name too, so we need that too. That's if you pass your uh. That's if you pass your protest, but you know, you're gonna pass your protest. I don't see you not passing the protest. If you don't pass the protest, that was definitely that was just my fault. All right, let's speed this up. Don't yell at him. He knew he he's gonna be all right. Don't worry about it. Coach is tight, you know coach. You know how coach is. Coach, we're gonna get him right. You know what I'm saying? I, yeah, I know, I feel you. Super featherweight, uh, Nani? All of that, all of those. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, first things first, we gotta get you bulking, man. We gotta get you in the gym and we gotta get you, I think it's said Africa. Oh, damn, I didn't even see you say Africa. Or well, at least you, you're American. Sorry. Sorry you that you gotta be American, but you're American, son. How much money is that? Thirty-four thousand dollars is way too much money. How much money is this? Fifty-four, that's pretty decent. We need you on uh on that right there. This is it right here. Take a snapshot, look at it, remember it. This is to get you going. Okay? It's not it's not cheap, but it's not overly expensive. Fifty four hundred dollars is definitely gonna put you in the red really quickly. But what's gonna happen is you're gonna be able to bulk up, get a lot of power, get a lot of speed, get a lot of life. And also being that you're you're having a couple of days off, you're not gonna be fucking um you're not gonna have a lot of bad health and you're not gonna have fatigue. So we're going to put this into production, and then we're going to come back in a little bit. Oh, actually, I think I could throw a little splash of water on there, too, and that not affect anything. 50 is still 54. Okay, good. You need, you need a little bit of water. You need a little bit of water to wash it all down. Coach just asking you, should you play the, should he play the lottery? I think he should play the lottery. Play the lottery, Coach. I mean, you never know. You may get some money. Maybe Juju... Maybe maybe little Gary may be the uh he may be the um you know what I'm saying the little luck we need to win that win that jackpot. Everybody wanna introduce themselves. Boy, that boy gonna start gaining weight quick though, ain't he? Seventeen though, he's seventeen. We're gonna actually put off the protest for a little bit too. We're not gonna take the protest immediately. 300k. To, oh God. Everybody want to meet you. Everybody want to meet you. You, you real popular. You real popular. That's cool. That's cool. But I, I got. 
We got things to do. We got training camps to do. We got to get him right for the uh, for the protest, man. Already up to super featherweight. And climbing. What happened? Oh, he won! He won! Gary! Gary, you are lucky, bro. I'm telling you, that first character was trash, dogs. That first character was ass cheeks. It was bad juju. It was bad juju, man. This character is it. This character may be the one, bro. He just won the gym 100 million yen. 100 million yen, dogs? You know what we could do? Now you can eat as much as your heart desires, bro. And you cannot worry about going into debt. So you can get big and strong. Ni hao. Konnichiwa. Nani? Damn. That's crazy. That's crazy. Boy, eat as much as you want. But this is not... I'm going to tell you right now. This is not going to happen every 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 time. So, what I did was put you on a um, regimen that's going to, you know, help you. Oh, luckily, Coach. You don't even know what to say. I think a mouth is stuck open. Pick up your jaw, Coach. I did help you with a, a, a regimen that's going to help you, you know, get some money. I mean, save some money. But let's see. Let's check out the bank account. Let's check out the bank account. 103 million yen. So we good. We good for a while. Ni hao. Life and concentration got to go up. Life is going up. So now you don't have to worry about your debt. Debt. You'll make your debt back immediately. So this is the dude that's destined to be a world champ. It was already destiny. Already destiny. Spoken into existence. All right. Our life is going up well. Let's see what else is going up well. Dash speed power is going up well. Solid power is going up well. Your life is what helps you not get knocked out, honestly. The more life you have, the more you're, you're going to be able to keep getting up from getting knocked down. And your bad health is what helps you um, actually take a punch. Like, when, if you get punched and you notice your, your boxer actually, like, keel over, you know what I'm saying? You actually notice your boxer, uh, like, uh, get fucked up with every punch. That means you, you got bad health. Your bad health is high. We're not going to take the protest. We're actually going to wait. We're going to put it. We're going to wait till you get at least, like, what? Um, I want to say like what 160 something like that We want to get at least 100k life that'd be nice At least for at least to start out Um Let's see we need to tweak a couple of things to get the speed right Um I'm gonna lower the food down a little bit and the water. This should be cheap. This is 1400. And what we're going to do is um, put our speed and power up right there. And what that, oh, actually, no. Actually, we want it all to be, e oh no. We actually wanted this to stay even because If, um, yeah, if, uh, if we actually, if we actually mess, if we actually kind of fuck with this, um, that may actually mess up our, uh, what we're trying to accomplish with the speed and everything. And we may not gain as much weight as we want to gain too. See, we're not gaining as much weight as fast as we was before. But our, um, we're going to put off the, we're going to put off the uh, protest for one more, one more time. Our speed and power, our speed and power is actually looking pretty good right now. There's already 200k for speed and power. Life is doing, looking good. 
fat, bad health and fatigue. This is the this is it right here, dogs. This is how you do it. Now, if you was to stay at welterweight, you would basically want to, you know, tinker with the um the meals so that way you don't go overweight. But um we don't want to we don't want to stop. We don't want to stay there. We want to actually keep going up and wait. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop down. We're going to have a, a couple less days off. We're going to have two days off. Um, all of it, all of it is, is really, you know, uh, is really science, man. You know, you, you got to just keep tinkering with things and find out what works and what uh, situations. Because, um, damn it. Because, uh, you think, what was that, DMK? You think, uh, you think one thing is going to work for everybody and it doesn't, it really doesn't. If you try this, uh, if you were to try this diet with a different character, it may not work out as well as you would think. So I didn't, I didn't anticipate in us. I didn't anticipating us. I didn't anticipate us staying at welterweight, but it looks like this is where we're going to, where we're staying right now. We may have to, uh, continue to bulk and see what that does. Let's actually work on um on on stamina. Stamina is what helps you with uh is what helps you with life. And let's actually get us some days off too. We are gaining weight, but we're gaining weight slowly. We're gonna actually take the protest here, so it looks like welterweight main. I don't want to, uh, like you said, you don't want to stay at welterweight, but we can take a fight at welterweight and then and then try to go up, try to go up and wait. Like I said, we have a lot of money to play with, so we're at super welterweight now. Life is at 120. Bad health and fatigue is good. Hand speed is good. Speed is looking really good. Speed average could be a little bit better. Footwork speed could be better. Uh, footwork speed is... Oh, the speed actually is going down, so... We're going to have to... Uh, we're going to have to level that out. So that way, it all... Um, the more you work on one thing, you'll start to neglect other things. So if you start to work on power your uh, stamina and your speed will start to go down. If you start to work on the stamina, your speed and power will go down. So that's why you have to work on things evenly to maintain your uh, your abilities. So now our footwork speed and our dash speed is going to start to go back up. And we're starting to gain weight uh, really decently. So that's really actually good too. So we actually may uh, take the protest at middleweight. All right, coach. Damn, shut up. Yeah, we may be a middleweight. Middleweight may be good, man. Middleweight may actually be a really good way to start. In all honesty. Round one. Mound one. Looking good. Looking good. Okay. All right, dude is pretty strong that you fighting. He got abs. That's that's all right, but it don't matter. I'm breathing heavy already. I don't know what is what is DMK. What does DMK mean? I don't know what that means. He's already starting to breathe heavy. I don't like that. Keep working that jab. Move your head, man. Good job. Good right hand, good right hand. Good left hand, excuse me. You are southpaw. I think I made you a southpaw, maybe, actually. You'll be able to, you'll be able to fight as a southpaw. You'll be all right. You'll be all right. Good job. Good job. One, 
Easy round one, man. It's light work, man. It's light work. It's light work. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's light work. Stay on him. Get on him. Oop. That's a that's a win. That's a win. You're a professional. Your body's looking good too. Oh, look at how how polite you are, bowing to every judge. Man, you were such a nice kid, man. Your parents taught you well, man. You got really good manners, man. Good kid, man. You're a good kid. We almost a million dollars in debt, but you're <laughs> you a good kid. Um, yeah, let's keep uh Um in all honesty, we could um What what's your real name, man? You wanna know what your real name is? Gary P, Gary V, Gary H, Gary L. All right, just Gary. Just playing Gary. We could just play Gary. All right. That works. That works. Oh, all right. You wait till after. All right. Um, we're gonna take a. We're not gonna take a fight at middleweight, man. Oh no, we're not gonna take a fight at middle at middleweight. We're gonna take a fight at at uh. Oh, actually, super middleweight is not open yet, so we don't have a choice but to take a fight at middleweight. So let's let's give you a uh, dude to build your confidence against. A dude that, uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know about that guy. I'm gonna find you a good opponent. Your good first opponent. He's one to know. Alright, we're gonna get you this guy. He's one to know. He ain't that nice, man. Just because he's one to know, that, that always, somebody's always got to go. Alright? We're gonna give you like 150 days to play around with. You know? We want to give you a couple days to play around with. All right, we have to ease up on the uh, on the thing on the bobs. Now that uh, now that you're a professional, we have to ease up on the. Uh, we have got to ease up on the uh, on the snickerdoodles. We got to ease up on the damn the pastries. We got to ease up on the all that shit. So. You're a professional now. You gotta know how to make weight. God damn it. God damn it. All right, there we go. Instead of triple G, you double G. Gary G. See, this is the lose weight. That's a lose weight uh, right there. We don't want. We don't really want you losing too much weight. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna give you a little bit of water. Give you some wawa. Give you some wawa. And bump up your uh, bump up your proteins a little bit more. Let's see what happens. Dashby is going up, which is what we like to see. All right, we can actually, um, we can, um, is that gonna make you tired? It's, it's making you gain weight, so that's good. You are tired, so. Um, let's, uh, we got 90 days, so we have 90 days to play around with. Bad health is kind of high. 
I think around like the uh, 50 day mark, we're going to start start going into rest mode. We need just speed to be up there. Speed got to go up. We need just speed higher. Sway speed could be better, man. I would like your sway speed to be a little bit better, but you know. Neck is the neck is good. Pause. Your body is looking good. It's very proportionate for a young guy. No homo. Uh, your life is at 200k. That's really good. You're looking good, man. You're looking good. I just would like for your speed to be a little bit better, bro. Need your speed to be a little bit better, bro. Okay, we have the 50 day mark. So let's uh let's start going to the rest mode. Start getting you in the rest. Get you in the rest mode. Cut down the food. Hopefully you don't start gaining too much weight. Alright, you good. Dash speed could be a little bit better. 129, I don't know. We need to get some more. We need you to rest, bro. Oh, actually, you pretty, you good on rest. No, I, no, no. We could. Oh. Uh, no, we could. Uh, you could do a little. You could do a little bit more resting, man. You could do a little bit more resting, man. We gonna cut that. Give you just water only. You know what I'm saying so that way you can chill out for the rest of the, for the rest of training camp. Hopefully stuff doesn't start to fall too much. Uh. One fifty nine, looking good, baby. You looking good? Let's see what you got. Let me show me what you got, Gary. We gave you a really good opponent. He's not the. He's not the. You know. A world champ or anything or a regional champ you know you got you a decent guy that i think that uh you'll do well against you know you need a little bit more speed but you know that we can work on stuff like that Show me what you got. Show me what you got, man. My man's pro debut. Non title match. It happens, man. I've lost protests. I've definitely lost protests. I've gotten draws and protests. Definitely had a couple of fighters come to the gym and, you know, you think that they're ready and they're not ready. But right, we showing you here, right here on the blueprint. The blueprint is to start as, as to, to be as, as, you know, non-technical as possible. When you're making your character, you want to make him as light and as skinny as possible. All right, my man's 18 already. You want to make him as light and as skinny as possible. 
and leading up to your protest, you can decline it like two or three times, depending on you know how much you eat. But you want to gain as much weight and as much stat as po as much stats as possible before turning pro. But you also gotta you also have to uh, box smart, man. You gotta box smart. If you treat this game like fight night, it's, it's gonna it's gonna be bad to you, man. I don't know what he thought he was going to get off in that angle, but I don't exactly know what he thought he was going to get off in that angle, but that ain't it. That wasn't it. And it's all about also they thought of everything when it comes to um, a boxing game and not and not thought of everything in a boxing game as in terms of you know making it a really good game they thought of it in terms of it being as true to life to boxing as possible so when you're building a character you can't unless you're absolutely certain that he's a great a great character and you know he's you know destined to be you know unbeaten and can't nobody beat him and your stats are exactly where you want him to be you should probably you know build his career slowly by taking you know lower competition and in turn building your character slowly because you know if you give him a guy that's that's got a really good record and he's you know shredded and stuff like that and he's gonna run circles around you because you may have weaknesses in your game that you haven't filled up yet like your speed, your speed is not world class level. You know your power is decent for for the Japanese level, and your um your stamina is decent, but uh, you still got you still got holes in your game. So you you got to take all of these things into account when um when you build your character. So um we're gonna try to focus on we're gonna try to focus on the um your power and your speed and things of that nature make sure that that's right make sure you're not eating too much i think coach wants to put you in a tournament see yeah he, he sees a lot of potential in you now this is what we're gonna say do you want to do you want to stay undefeated or do you care about your undefeated record do you want to actually you know push for greatness you know, a lot of boxers these days they don't they don't try for greatness. You know, they want to have the, the the clean undefeated record. You know, try to go to a a, a world class level and, and they get exposed. Some of them they actually can can withstand you know being at that level until they get put up against somebody else's undefeated and then they get the ass beat. So, you know, and I'm gonna leave this decision up to you. It's your guy, man. Do you wanna do you wanna actually try for greatness? This is a class. He said this is a class. I'm saying this is a class level. He says it's a class. I don't know if it's actually a class. If they're actually a class dudes, so you know, I think you may be ready. You know, I think you may be be able to win a championship in the uh, in the tournament. But you know, if you if you still wants to uh, if you still want to work on a couple of things, and you know, let me know, man. I say yes, man. I say you should do it, B. Let's do it. Let's do it. My man said he want to go for greatness. He said he don't. He said put that undefeated record on the on the line, man. You don't really know how good you are until you go up against real competition. And you don't want to know that you ain't ready for real competition when you get there. Once you get on the biggest stage, you want to be tested early. I'm going to be honest with you. A lot of dudes in boxing that's undefeated, they ain't really undefeated, man. I would say Ryan Garcia, my man's undefeated for real. You know, 
He been tested. Tank, I would say he undefeated for real. Bud, Earl, I say they undefeated for real. But once they face each other, they ain't gonna be undefeated for long, you know. Everybody look at the Floyd Mayweather thing and be like, oh, you know. You just you supposed to stay undefeated, you know? You ain't never supposed to take a loss. You take a loss, you a bum, bro. You took a loss? Wow. I can't believe you took losses. How's your uh May wait? I'm 59 and a, and a quarter. I think you're ready, man. I think you're ready. Fatigue and bad health is all right. Okay. Life is good. Speed could be a little bit better, but you know what I'm saying? You, you got to risk it, man. You got to do things. Let's go, Gary. Show me something, Gary. Okay, okay. Man, coming to the ring dancing, swagging and shit. That's cute. You don't fuck about none of that, dogs. You don't fuck about none of that, man. Oh, he got that bum ass, bum ass uh, Tyson roll. Look, look, I like how tall you are too, man. Oh, he got a high guard. Uh, that's bad, man. I'm not gonna lie. I like how good you are, man. You already got to moving slow. Are you already got to moving slow? Gary. Gary, you looking bad. You looking like a bad man, man. You looking like a bad boy. Fuck out of here. <laughs> Get out the way. Roll out the way. No kato. No kato. I don't know what they thought, but you know. Gary G here to Gary G here to get that championship, bro. Gary G here to get that championship, bro. I'm mad I can't see the other side of the bracket. Like that, that really annoys me. But whatever. Yeah, I need to make sure my man isn't um doing nothing to make sure he's overweight.
30 days, man. That shit come, that shit come real fast, bro. In tournaments, you have to stay in shape. If you don't stay in shape, man, I said you out of the tournament immediately. No questions about it, so. We can afford to, um, add a little bit more, add a little bit more meat on your plate. Dash speed going up, footwork going up. Looking good, you looking good, champ. You looking good, champ. Meat, I'm telling you, meat is what gets you, is what, amino acids in general is what, uh, is what gets your shit right. You need the amino acids, which is meats and, um, you know, uh, 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 what do you call that shit? Meats and proteins, basically. So, steaks, shrimps, fucking shit, things of that nature that give you protein. That's what builds muscle and, you know, helps you, you know, be fast and move around the ring. And, yeah, basically, overall, get your stats up. Water basically supplements it, keeps you, keeps it on, and it doesn't make it fake, you know. Having this game is going to teach you a lot about fucking nutrition. I'll tell you that much. You know, I don't do this much nutrition shit for, my, for myself, and I'm already playing fucking... I'm already playing a couple of games that take you on a fucking roller coaster. Let's go, Gary. Show him something, man. Show me some G. Show me some G. My man, 27 years old. All right. From EJ Kondo. From the EJ Kondo. Look at, look at Gary. Looking lean. Okay. Your body looking right. You getting, you getting strong. A little 18 year old. Okay. Nice little young whippersnapper. I see a lot of man. I see a lot of potential in this kid, man. Stop. You want, I want you to keep moving that jab, man, and keep moving. Jab and move to the right. Jab and move to the right. Move your head. Jab, jab. Get them angles. Get them angles. Mm hmm. Don't stand, don't stand right in front of him. Don't stand right in front of him. That's probably what he want, man. Keep moving. Jab and move. He's slow for a reason. If he's slow, he's probably slow for a reason. He probably got power. That's what I always say, man. If they slow, they slow for a reason. They got power behind that that slow, them slow ass punches. Keep jabbing him from the outside. Keep breaking him down. Go to the body. Keep jabbing from the outside and go to the body. Thank you. Thank you. You're looking good, baby. You looking good. Gary G. Gary, my G. All right, my G. Show me that lead left hook. Show me that lead left hook, baby. Show me that real hook. Show me that four. Show me that four. Show me that one four. Show me that 4-1. Show me that 4-1. Good counters. Good counters, baby. Good counters. Don't get overly aggressive. Don't chase him. Don't chase him. Don't get overly aggressive. Don't chase him. Don't chase him. G. G. That's how we that's how you doing, G. 
G, man. If you want to keep boxing like that, this tournament going to be easy. I ain't going to lie to you, bro. You keep boxing like that, this is going to be an easy tournament. Don't reach. Don't reach. Don't reach because he's almost as tall as you are. So we don't really got an advantage there. Don't reach. Don't get in this kitchen. I want you to keep him at a distance like you had with that jab and keep working that one. I want to give you a 1-4 or a 4-1. Okay? Keep giving me them jabs. Them jabs is beautiful. Jab, keep moving to your right. Move your head, baby. You're looking beautiful out there. Wonderful. Wonderful round. Wonderful round. He gonna try to he gonna try to draw you in. That's why you're trying to go on the ropes. You're trying to bait you in with a little rope of dough. Man, we ain't gonna fall for that. Keep your distance. You know what I'm saying? If he wanna be on the ropes, let him. And if he wanna come at you, make sure he entered that. If he entered that pocket, he get met with a jab. If he enters that pocket, make sure he enters that pocket and he get met with a jab. Just like that. Just like that. Move to your right. Like I said. Good lead left hook. Good lead right hook. Good lead hooks. Like I said, one three, one four. Or four one. Man, we got hit with a jab as you entered. But I said, watch your feet too. Watch your feet. Line up that. Yeah, there you go. Good job lining up them twos. Go to the body. Good job. Good job. Good job. Beautiful setup. Beautiful setup. Yeah, move yeah, baby. Moved up. Get off that angle. Get off that angle. Make sure you're make, being that you're a southpaw. I want that right foot. I want that right foot to be outside of his left foot. I want that. I want that right foot to be on the on the outside of his left foot, so you can get that that left hand right down the middle. You understand? Get that. Get that left hand right down the middle. You're a little bit tired. You're a little bit tired. Fall back. You're a little bit tired. You're a little bit tired. Keep using that jab. You already dropped him, so you won this round. You don't got to do nothing extra special. You don't got to go in for the kill. You already got the knockdown. Stay smart. Keep boxing smart. Beautiful round. You already got the knockdown. 55% on the punch stats. You're looking good, baby. You're doing everything that I told you to do. You're doing everything that I told you to do, Gary. Good at taking direction. That's what I like. That's why we, that's why we brought you into the gym. I'm glad that you came into the gym, you know, and you you was in search of, of some help, and I'm here to help. We're here to make world champions out here. I don't know. I don't know how far that you can go at 160, but I know if you listen to me and we do this together, we're going we gonna to be able to take this as far as we want to take it. I don't know what the future holds. Keep working that jab. Keep working that distance, too. If you try to close that distance, you back out and you make your own distance. Good counter hooks. 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 Keep working that jab. Don't chase him. Don't when he go to that rope, don't chase him. Good job. Pull you seen that pull jab? Beautiful pull jab. Beautiful pull jab. Make sure you keep that. Make sure you keep that right foot on the outside. So you get that left hand. Good job. Good job. Get that left hand. Woo! Get that left hand. Keep that foot on the outside. Beautiful. Now you can get that left hand off. Good jabs. Good jabs. Easy jabs. Easy jabs. Got good reach for a reason. That's why we got the reach. That's why we got the reach. You don't really gotta move your feet. We could work on your feet. Your feet can always get worked on. 
See if you can move to the right. Uh, yeah, keep moving left and right and get that get that left hook off. Ni hao. Ni hao. That's it. Fight over. That's it. Fight over. Beautiful work. These dudes is easy work, man. These dudes is easy work. This is a tournament? This is a tournament? I, I, wow. These guys is in a tournament? I ain't know that. Meow. Here to the quarterfinals. See what we need to work on. Still need to work on speed, but we got to make sure that our uh, fatigue and bad health is low. You know what I'm saying? We don't want that to be any any higher than it already is. Right, let's see. Let's see what we got here. What up, coach? I don't. I don't speak Japanese, bro. I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I, I don't know what you're saying, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie. All I, all I speak boxing. You know what I'm saying? I speak boxingese, bro. That's all I speak is boxingese, dogs. And right now, my boxingese is at an all-time high. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. Woo, cause you know, you could, you could go overweight quickly. You could fuck around and go overweight quick, bro. Heavy power is at 300k. That's looking good. That's looking good. We're looking really good, man. Heavy power and solid power is looking good. Our speed is going up. 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 Our speed is going Quarterfinals is looking good. One seventy eight, bro. You you a little bit overweight, dogs. You keep missing weight. You gonna uh, you're not gonna be able to fight no more, man. You gotta put that. You want to lose weight? You gotta use that uh that recipe that I showed you just now. <coughs> you want to lose weight? <coughs> Make sure to put your speed up, all speed. You gotta work on speed. After um after a certain amount of years, super middleweight and light heavyweight and heavyweight um opens up so you can move up in weight, but. When you first start the game, when you start the game in like 2006, um, the highest that you can go is uh, middleweight. Oh, this dude is nice. He's a four-round boxer. And he's had 19 fights, 18 knockouts, and seven losses. I mean, been around the block for a while. Okay, you want to have a little competition here? Let me show. Show me some. Show me some. You 18. You have to show me some. My man's my man's record was incredible, but that don't mean nothing. That don't mean nothing to me. Y'all could get knocked down the same, bro. Oh, he's fast. He is fast. He made you slow too. Oh, 
Oh, you slowed him down too significantly. Oh, no. Not that much. Not that much. Keep using that jab. Keep using that jab. He's going to try to... He's going to try to keep moving in and out. Keep using that jab. That's going to be the key to this fight. And do not stay in do not stay in front of him. Because you're already slow. He already hurt you. You're hurt. You're hurt. He went to the body. Them body shots is hurting. Body shot. See? Another another body shot. That hurt. You can win the percentage game. You can win the percentage game. Move, move your feet, Gary. Gary, move your feet. This guy's really fast. He's moving in and out on you. Keep j oh my god, Gary. Gary, jab and move your feet, bro. You already hurt. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Whenever he whenever he enters the pocket, move your head. Do not jab. Just move your head immediately. Make sure your head is make sure your head is out the way. Keep jabbing when you get a chance. If we find an opening. Find your range. Get that jab off where you can. But his movement, his angles is really going to be throwing you off right now. So, See? He's already, you're already slow. You may have had a better percentage, but uh, well, there ain't no way to tell. Have a seat, man. Have a seat, dogs. Have a seat, man. Forty percent. That's not good. Put some ice on his neck, man. Put some ice on his neck. I'm gonna need you to jab, and when he enters the pocket, when he goes, when he goes with that little in and out, those little movements, I need you to don't meet him with a jab. You got the better percentage. Don't meet him with a jab. Meet him with head movement. Try to make him go. Try to make him go to the body, and if he goes to the body, hit him with some uppercuts. He got the speed on you, so you're going to have to figure something else out, man. In all honesty, I would say you have to hit him with... Oh, damn. Gary! Get up, man. You're all right. You're all right. You're going to have to be on your front foot shit, too. Because letting him create all the angles is not going to... It's not going to help. You're going to have to keep him at the end of your jab. You're not going to be able to to, um, to counter punch him. You, I'm telling you, you counter punch him, you're going you're gonna to lose a counter punch battle. Oh, drugged him. Gary got drugged there bad. Uh-huh. Jab to the head, jab to the body. Oh, boy. That's it. That's it, Gary. That's it, man. It was tough, man. You you know, you put up a good fight coming this far in the, in the uh, tournament, but uh, his speed was way too much. You could tell. You could tell his speed was just going to give you fits. That's why I wanted to keep working on speed with you, but, you know tough uh, that's a tough way to you know go out you still got another fight in a loser's bracket so we still got to get you in shape can't afford to uh you know you can't afford to mess around and you know damn man that's that's tough that's a tough one to take man you know, would it like for you to stay undefeated, but you know. You can work on things. You still got a lot of you still got a lot to work on, man. You're really young. You're eighteen. A lot of dudes wouldn't have even taken this wouldn't have even taken this uh this test right here, man. A lot of dudes wouldn't even taken this test this early in their career, man. That's for real. 
So you get my you get my respect for even doing that, man. You get in the fight in the losers bracket, but you know you still get some you still get something out of it. Hey, 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 hey. My man ain't wanna fight. Oh, he's three and three. Okay. I actually saw this dude in the rankings that you could fight. Kenyatamo. Kenyatamo. Let's have a good fight, Kenya. Kenya's fast. If he's just gonna keep walking in with his hands down, make him pay. You think he got fast hands, but you got faster hands, trust. Blowing his load, man. You gotta do something about your stamina, too. I feel like your stamina could be a little bit better. Looking beautiful here. The other dude was just a little bit more experienced than you. You know, it's all right. It happens. It happens, man. Sometimes you meet dudes that's better than you in there, you know? Dudes that's undefeated, like I said, man, they ain't real. They ain't all real. That, that means they ain't really ain't been tested. You ain't been tested as much as you, as you should have been tested. Terrence Crawford, he's been tested, but when he fight when he fight Earl Spence, that's when he's really gonna be tested. Earl Spence has been tested, but he's really gonna be tested when he fight Bud Crawford. You know what I'm saying? Tank is tested, but you know, Zan Desire, these dudes have been tested, but Boots in this, they test Boots. I don't even think Boots really been tested. Like, you know what I'm saying? Charlo been tested. Charlo been tested. Jamel Charlo, not, not Jamal. He just want to keep entering the... Keep entering the pocket like that. That's, that's on him. Stupid. Entered right into the pocket and got met with a lead right hook. I mean, you you get to go into the loser bracket, but you know. Good fight. Good fight, man. Good fight. Man that you mean that you've already been tested. We're gonna give you another test. We're gonna go up in the ranks. Damn, they can let you they can let you go up pretty high in the ranks, huh? Oh you can fight a six let's yeah, let's give you a real test. Let's let you fight a six rounder. I'm gonna give you a tough guy. Well, somewhat tough. Well, that's, he's tough. He's tough. He'd be tough too. 150 days out. Should be fine. 
I'm going, you're going to step up in competition, kid. Give you a little boost in comp. Hope you learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Speed going to go up. Speed is going to get right. Everything going to get right, bro. We're going to get you right. We're going to get you right, playboy. Speed, man. Speed. Lower your lower your food intake and increase your, your speed training. So if you want to lose weight, this right here. This right here helps you lose weight. And you wanna you wanna have um like that. The more speed that the more speed training that you do, the more you'll lose weight. That helps that helps you shred pounds, in all honesty. For real. For real, for real. Honestly, these this um Honestly, this little diet that I'm on right now helps you lose weight too, but we're adding a lot more um a lot more protein so that way we can get our, our speed up the way we want it to. Where's that? What is the stamina at? Endurance is okay. It's, endurance can be a little bit better in all honesty. So we're getting our speed the way we wanted to. We're getting the power the way we wanted to. I think this is a good um I think this is a good mixture of speed of uh getting everything up and not focus on one thing over the other. It's it's going slowly, it's going at a, a snail's pace, but we are ensuring that everything is going up. We just have to, uh, you know, pick our fights accordingly, make sure that we not bite off too much more than we can chew. In all honesty, what we could do is um, lower that. Mm hmm. Here we go. That's looking good. That's looking real good right there. Hand speed is, is really high. Speed average is really high. Foot speed, okay. Foot speed and dash speed is going up. Sway speed is going up. Power is what's really high, is what's really high. You may be a world champ at middleweight. I'm not gonna lie. At middleweight, you can fuck around and be a champ. If anything, we could try to we could make you lose a couple of pounds, and you could you could uh you know you could be better too. I see, I see a lot of good things in your future, man. The power is what's crazy. You got a lot of power. Now, we could, I think we could actually hire you a trainer too. I think we could hire you a, a trainer and a um a, a doctor too. That could probably help you out. Twenty years old, you're still eighteen, man. You fighting you a six rounder for the first time. I think you're ready. I think you're ready, bro. Let's see. Oh, this dude is not much better than you at all, bro. This dude is not much better than you, bro. Keep popping that jab. That ain't going to cut it. Keep working that body, work that body. Work that body, that's what's you work that body, everything else is gonna fall in place. Mm-hmm. Keep hitting him with them jabs. If he ain't gonna block or move, keep hitting him. Make sure you get your distance though. Make sure you get your distance. Don't see. Good job. 
Good job, bro. And I'm with a lead hook. Lead hook, bro. There you go. Gary G, your first fight at, in, in the six rounders. You got a knockout already. Got a knockout already. You looking good in the first round too, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That's what I'm saying. The power is what's crazy to me. The power is what's crazy to me. Heavy power is really good. Um, yeah, absolutely. You got to move. You got to move to America right now. He's ready. See, he sees it like I see it. You got so much potential. He, he's ready to move you to a different country right now. Yeah, let's go to the U.S. Let's go to the U.S. Right, right away. Let's not even wait. Let's not even play around. Let's not even play around, bro. Alright, I'm gonna move you to America, bro. It's time, man. It's time to take your career serious, man. You spent enough time in Japan. It's cool, but, you know, I think it's time for you to actually, you know, spread your wings, man. Um, Do we give you a tune-up, or what do we do? We keep pushing you forward? I say we keep pushing you forward, man. We give you a dude that's one and know. Let me look at his body. Oh, yeah, absolutely. This is a good fight for you. This kid's a good fight for you. Let's put it in 63 days. So that way we can get this fight out the way. You can move to America. We can start setting up for uh, maybe, you know, world title. I don't know if they have you ranked. Do they have you ranked at, for for the world title? I'd, I'd be surprised, but we'll see. We'll see. No. Nope. 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 But, I mean, if you get a championship, you never know. So, we'll see. We'll see. Speed and power is looking good, man. You could even move up and wait, man. I think it would be it will be better if you moved up and wait. But if you want to conquer and clear out middleweight, let's do it. I'm, I'm for whatever you want to do. If you want to go down and wait and try to get and try to get fucking super super welterweight, yeah, let's do it. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You got whooped and what round or uh, what what like in like the first bracket I'm telling you got whooped in the opening bracket at least I got you to the quarter to the uh, quarterfinals and then you won the uh, the loser bracket but
Oh, you was too overweight. Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah, if you fighting that middleweight, yeah, bro, you, you, you damn near light heavyweight, bro. You, you bigger, you actually bigger than light heavyweight. You a cruiserweight. You got to lose a lot of weight. And you have to do it, you have to do it properly. You got to do it properly. If you just try to actually lose weight and then not eat, that's where the bad health comes in. You know, you understand? So you have to, you have to maintain enough food you have to maintain enough exercise so that way you know you don't go overweight you don't you know you don't uh be fatigued and stuff like that it's difficult man it's difficult you keep coming to the gym i'm, I'm sure we could uh we can help you out man that's what i love doing i love helping guys come into the gym they come into the stream and you know hopefully i, I could get you a world champ one day you know, it took me a lot of attempts to get uh, a world champion, and it took me even more attempts to get a, a character to be undisputed. So, if I can do it, anybody can do it. It's difficult. It took a lot of characters. Spun all the way around you. See, every time he bend down there, make sure you get him with a nice uppercut. You keep got you got hit with a couple straight rights that I don't want to see you get hit with. Good jab. Keep working that jab. Go to the body. Go to the jab. Keep going to that jab and keep going to that body. Mm-hmm. Good lead right hook. Good lead right hook. First round, another first round knockout, G. That's how you doing it? That's how you doing it, G? G, man. I'm telling you, once we once we get you figured out and you, you know, you figure out the uh, the weight and stuff like that, I'm telling you, you're going to be right. You're an American now. You out of, you out of Nihau land. Let's see if they got you rated at middleweight. Oh, you rated in the USBS? Oh, you're a six round boxer. Um, L1. Kevin Barry. 31 years old. So if you're using sway, you use L1 and bend down and punch to the body. Or if you're using the punch direction, you would use um you would use uh what you call it? The the L1 and the analog stick to to aim at the body. If you want, you can move up and wait because you're in America now. They got super middleweight here. Food is going to be cheaper too. It may be actually more difficult to uh, a class tournament. Yeah, why not? It may be more difficult to uh, maintain weight because you know when um, it's actually a B class tournament, not a class. But it may be more difficult to um, maintain weight here because, you know, American food is a lot more, uh, 
a lot more more fatty, a lot more uh, you know concentrates and shit like that. So making weight may be a little bit more difficult in America, but we'll see. It's, it is gonna be cheap, I'll tell you that much. Actually, let's um, let's see, let's see. It's five hundred dollars, so we are saving, we saving a shitload of money already. All right, we're losing weight, so need to put up the aminos a little bit. This is good, actually, because we're getting a lot of amino acids. We probably need, um, see, yeah. Having that many amino acids. Oh, God. See, having, being in America is fucking me up, too, because the weight is going to, um, the, the food and shit like that is going to fuck you up. All right, that's good. Oh, it is B-class. Okay, he did say B-class. Okay, I think we got the weight. I think we got the food figured out. We're going to have to add a little bit of uh, glucose to it. You're going to have to get a little bit of sugar in your diet. I don't know exactly how that's going to work with the weight and uh, and the stuff like that. But, you know, we'll see. Middleweight, non-title match, six-round match. We thought real highly of you bringing you to America, man. So this is this is serious stuff right here, dogs. All right? This is serious stuff, man. This is serious stuff bringing you to America. You know what I'm saying? They think that you that you're ready for the big time. USBC. You're 19 now, so time to start moving your career a little bit forward. Okay. Boy got the peekaboo defense. Jabs. Woo! Gee! Oh man, you looking good, man. You know, when you come from Japan, they be like, oh, you know, he fought in Japan. Who he fought? He fought, he fought real competition. Just because he, just because he was in Japan don't mean he ain't fought nobody. You done fought real competition in Japan. Absolutely. I don't want them to ever get it twisted and say that you ain't never fought nobody because you from Japan. Ain't no, it, it's no, there's no, uh. There's no difficulty sliders in this game either. You can't make it easy. You can't make it hard. You can't make it extra hard. It's just one difficulty out the box. Hard as fuck. No, no. There's only one difficulty out the box. Japanese. And if you know anything about JRPGs or Japanese games, you know them shits is all difficult as a motherfucker. So. Making good money, baby. Looking good. Nice little tournament. It's a B-class tournament, so this should be easy. Ni hao. Oh, look at your life. Your life is all the way at 300K. Stamina is up high, and endurance could be a little bit higher, but, you know, we're not worried about that. We're still worried about the speed, man. It's still taking a while for the speed to get up there, but when it, when it does, man, you'll be a totally complete fighter. I promise you. You will be a totally complete. Now, this is, look. Let me watch. Being that you're in America, food is a different. So you have you can eat a little bit more amino acids and and sugars, which is glucose. Glucose is sugars. Amino acids is protein. So sugars would be you know um, rice, uh, you know carbohydrates, bread, stuff like that. Amino acids would be uh, proteins like your steaks and 
um, chickens and stuff like that. Water is water. Obviously, fatty acids would be um, would be uh, uh, peanuts, um, uh, guacamole, fucking you know stuff like that. Oils. So um, I don't really like to put too much fat at all. You know, we we want to you know stay stay in shape. And we're doing a really good job of doing that and, and gaining the power that we need. So we're staying in shape. We're gaining power. Our body is getting really strong. Look at, like, you about to get abs in a little bit, boy. Okay, 19 years old with a little peach fuzz. I see you. I see you, boy. Neck, back is at 400. Paws, hips, thighs, calves is good. Abdomen, 300. Minerals is good, man. Minerals is good. You're getting a lot of minerals. You're getting a lot, getting a good amount of vitamins. Fat is low. Weight is good. Fatigue, bad health. Everything is looking good, man. Life is, is high. Let's see, let's see your opponent. Let's see your opponent. I don't usually like doing this. I like going into it cold, but let's see your opponent. He's a peekaboo style. He got pretty high endurance. Uh, his power is not as high as yours. Sway speed is a little bit higher than yours. Hand speed is not as high. Dash speed and foot speed is a little bit higher. But once you punch them one good time, I'm sure all that shit is going to go down, man. Trust. Um, 160. We fighting in... Oh, shit. We fighting in New York. You want to watch him? We could watch... Uh, we, he got some fight film. Let's watch some film, man. Let's see how he fights, man. Let's watch some film on the guy. He's the one in the ball. He's the ball guy. Oh, he's slow, man. He's slow. Oh, he's slow, but he's powerful. He got some power. I'm not concerned, bro. I don't see nothing that I'm concerned about, to be honest. He looks like he's a little bit of a pressure fighter. He ain't concerned about that. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. All right, peekaboo. Um, this is how you get the peekaboo. <clears throat> you go to this little tab right here, which is on the left hand side, right above your money and right above the life tab. And you go to your boxer. And this is like all of your shit, right? This is your info about you. This is your style. So you can change it from um, the hitman, <clears throat> boxer, fighter, fighter, hitman, peekaboo, open, freestyle. And that's also your character too. So, you know, lively, cheerful, normal, gentle, quiet. Um, you have special moves as well. Let's give you a special uppercut and let's, let's give you, let's give you the special lead, lead left hook technique. I forgot what technique is. I, I, I forgot. I don't want to, let's change up your uh, look too. It's been a while and you've been on a winning streak. So let's give you some, give you some dope trunks. All right, here we go. Get you a nice little style. Get you nice little blue trunks, blue gear, blue gloves. Oh, shit. Damn controller came loose. All 
That's a good thing about moving to New York. I mean, moving to New York. Well, you are you get to fight in New York. That's a good thing about moving to the states. You get to fight in you know the uh, American arenas early. You get to fight in New York. You get to fight in Vegas, and it's cheap. You don't have to worry about spending an arm and a leg and worrying about going broke. Let's go, Gary! Gary, not the snail. Gary, no Russell. Gary, no Peyton. Gary, no Vandercheck. Douglas Boone, 10 fights, 8 wins, 2 losses, 2 knockouts, so he's not really a knockout artist, you know, he got a couple losses on his on his docket, he's 19 years old from Harbor Tree Gym, let's see man, let's see what he got, I ain't, I ain't impressed man, we seen what he, we seen the, uh, the fight tape, I wasn't really impressed Gary, I ain't gonna lie to you bro, I wasn't impressed, that shit was, you know what I'm saying, I done seen better, better coming out of the youth, out of the youth division, man. I'm be real with you. Mm-hmm. Well, he's a southpaw too, actually, so we gotta be cautious. Mm-hmm. Look at how slow he got once you start hitting him with them shots. Woo! Cut in you, cut in on you. Cut that angle on you. Don't worry. Don't worry. We alright. We alright. You busting his ass, bro. You busting his ass. I'm not concerned. I, I can see you winning this this uh tournament. This tournament gonna be light work. They should call this the light work tournament. Oh shit, Gary! I'm talking all that shit. Get up, G. You alright, G. You alright. Dude's been knocked down before. Dude's been knocked down before, G. You know what I'm saying? I ain't worried about it. Like I said, this is still light work. You got caught. Because you was, you know what I'm saying? You wasn't focused. You lose concentration for one minute. That's what happened, so... You lost that round. It's all right. But he's hurt. He's hurt. You got him hurt. <clears throat> Trust me, you got him hurt. 49%. That was easy work. He just That was just a, a balance shot. You just caught you off balance. You wasn't hurt. Trust me. You'll be all right. I done seen dudes really get hurt. You wasn't hurt, man. Keep pumping that jab. Keep pumping that jab. That's what I'm saying. Keep pumping that jab, man. What I said. This shit is light work. This is easy work, dogs. Call this the easy work tournament, man. Keep turning, 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 turn the camera. Make sure you get the camera and get this and your set and your uh favor. There you go. Good lead hook. That Lee right hook is what's going, what's going, what's going to take you to to a championship. I'm telling you. Say don't. You know what I'm saying don't try to fight in his kitchen, man. Box him. You box a fighter. You fight a boxer. You understand? So if he want to fight you, you keep jabbing and moving. If he want to be all up in your kitchen and he want to fight close, you move. <laughs> He ain't, hit, he ain't got shit, man. We, we ain't worried. He ain't got shit. He ain't got shit. Like I said, this is easy work, bro. What I said, man, this is easy work. 
He hit him with it. He hit him with a little something, but he was that was more of a balance shot, if anything. You know, he was off balance. He wasn't really hurt in that fight at all. He wasn't hurt. I've seen fighters get hurt, man. Trust me, I've seen hurt fighters. He he wasn't hurt at all. This is the semi. This is the uh, semifinals right here, man. This is the semi. This is easy. This is light work. They should call this a light work tournament, maybe. Oh, let's actually save your character. Because if we start to get too far ahead and we start messing up, we're going to mess around and forget to save your character. So let's let's save your character. Alright, so we got your character. Let's see. Nihao. Um. Ready, coach. I'm ready. Ready. Power's looking good. What's our um, fatigue's a little bit high, but uh, I think we should be all right. And now, middleweight non-title match, six-round match. kid is good man this kid is good they don't want to believe it you know the reporters and stuff like that they look at them and they be like ah, I don't know I don't really see it you know he, he probably could you know lose use a little bit more work but I don't know man I, it's something about the kid I, I think he's ready for the likes of you know the the champions in the division man even though he's a six round boxer Ooh, careful, 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 move, move your feet, move your feet, babe, bro. Move your feet, babe, bro. He hurt you a little bit. His counter punches is good. He's doing a really good job moving. So you just got to keep moving, using that jab. Keep using that jab and keep moving your head. Trust me. That's going to be the key. There you go. There you go. There you go. He's also a southpaw too, so. Careful, careful. Don't try to get into a counter punch battle with him because he's really good at counter punching. Do not get into a counter punch battle with him. See, so you got caught again. You got caught again, trust me. Good uppercut. Keep moving, keep moving your feet. Nigga punch you in the butt. What the fuck was that about? You're hurt, you're hurt, bro. You are hurt. 
You are hurt, dogs. Do not get it confused. Do not get it confused. You got a good percentage though. Fifty-three percent ain't bad. Get your bearings back. Have a seat, man. Put some ice on them. Thirty-one percent. That was good. That was good, man. You outboxed him that round. But I mean, he definitely got the he definitely got you in the power department. He probably got you with the speed department and the counter punching department too. So you gotta be careful. You don't fuck around and get hurt. I'm serious. Stop. Stop trading with him. Stop trading with him. He don't got shit for you if you don't trade with him. You keep trading with him, that's going to be your demise. Get the fuck out of there. Keep him on the end of that jab and keep your head moving. You hurt him, see? You hurting him with that jab. You hurting him with that jab. Let him get tired. Let him get tired. Let him get tired. He's gonna throw the kitchen sink at you. And throw combinations to the body to slow him down. Get your breath, get your breath, get your wind back. Keep that jab. Jab, jab, move. Jab, jab, move. Move. Jab, jab, readjust every time. And go to the body. Beautiful round. Beautiful round. 55%. That's beautiful. This jab is going to be the key, baby. He's going to keep weaving them. He's going to keep trying to weave them hooks. So don't, don't. Don't try to keep going for them hooks. And he's way he's a way body counter puncher. So don't give him no counter punching opportunity. That's all he wants to do is counter punch you. So what we're gonna do is keep giving him two jabs and readjust. Don't try to keep letting your hands go. The more you let your hands go, the more opportunity you're gonna give him to move his head and hit you with uh, with counter punches. Alright? You out you outboxing him all day. He got 36%, you got 55%. You outboxing him all day. Just keep using that jab and keep moving. Do not Get complacent and do not let him let him stand in the middle and throw hands with you. Jab, jab, readjust. Do not stand toe to toe with him. Careful, see? Of course, you with a couple of counter punches. Jab, jab, move. You beating him. You beating him with that jab. Don't try to, don't try to do no more than that. Jab in the hook. I'm saying you, you sneaking a couple of hooks in there. Set him up with that hook. You can't just throw it naked. You can't just throw that hook naked. You gotta set that shit up, baby. Same thing with that right hand. See? Same thing with that right hand. Good jabs, good jabs, good jabs, good head movement. Keep moving your head, keep moving, baby. You hurting him with that jab. You hurting him. He's getting hurt, trust me. Jab, jab, readjust. It's a beautiful round, beautiful round. Beautiful round. Beautiful round. Keep controlling distance, man. You controlling distance beautifully, 50%. Keep putting 50s and above on the board and you want to win the fight, man. You know what I'm saying? Jab is going to be the key to this fight. Uh-huh. Look, keep hit him up. Uh, keep hitting him under. You know what I'm saying? Get on get up in there. Uh. Uh. 
Um, you're probably um eating too much. If you're doing, if you're getting game over, you're probably uh keep missing weight, or you're eating more money than your gym has money, right? You start with um five hundred thousand dollars, and then the more you eat, yeah, the more you eat, the more you go into debt. So your gym only gives you your gym only gives you three million dollars to play around with. So if you uh if you decide that um you know you waste that money, that's game over right there. They don't have no more money. They're bankrupt. Or or if you're trying like if you're um trying to make a fight, if you try to make a fight that uh, may cost the gym too much money, that may be game over too. Passing, I think, helps you get money too. I think get get is um what what splits money. Passing helps you um save money if I can remember. There's no real split, so most of that money goes into your pocket if I can remember. Pro oh my goodness! Don't worry, you'll be all right. You'll be all right. You'll be all right, G. You're all right, G. Even with the knockdown, you can still be winning the fight, man. Don't get discouraged. Don't get discouraged, man. I'm telling you. You'd be, you be surprised. You think, oh, I got the knockdown. I I lost. Nah. You can still get a win with a knock, with after being knocked down, bro. Trust. Let him keep missing, man. Let him keep missing. Get out of there. Get out of the corner. Beautiful job. Beautiful job making a miss. Beautiful job making a miss. Fifty nine percent, but it all went to it all went to the wayside because you got dropped. But it's still a good round, nonetheless. I'm not gonna lie. Is this the final round? Nope. We need two good rounds of boxing, man. Two good rounds of boxing, and you got this. Trust me. Oliver's doing a good job of cutting off the ring. Them, them lunges forward is uh, doing a really good job of closing distance. You're going to have to meet him. You're going to have to meet him at some point. He's doing what I keep telling you, though. Keep jabbing and moving. You're gonna have to jab and you're gonna have to move to your to your left. Um, I don't know, I maybe I may be going for a little bit longer. It may call them starting to get hungry. Jab, jab, move. Beautiful round, 58%. I'm telling you, one more good round and we gotta win. I know it. I know it's not gonna be pretty because you got a knockdown, but a win is a win, man. Trust me. Especially in a tournament. Especially when it when there's a championship on the line. I don't care what how the win came. Damn. Give a shot to the body. Yeah. 
If you got some, uh, if you got some footage of you in the gym, I'm gonna take. I can take a look. See what you're doing wrong. See where you can correct a couple of things. Bring me into the gym as like a secondary coach. Get you right. And I had plenty of guys coming to the gym trying to learn trade secrets. You know, a lot of them don't stick around. We do all sorts of boxing here. We do boxes road, we do fight night, we do undisputed when that comes out. Retro knockouts when that comes out. Um yeah. Combat sports. Fucking THQ undisputed UFC. All sorts of uh all sorts of combat sports around here. GTA as well. So if you're into combat sports, if you're in the, uh, if you're in the business of uh, watching people get hurt, you come to the right place. It was a good fight, man. Besides the, the round where you got knocked down, this was a good fight. You know, you absolutely outboxed them from, from round one to round six, so. There's nothing to be ashamed about, even though you got knocked down. What? In what world did you lose that fight? In what? What? You outboxed them every round. What are they talking about? 10-10. Excuse me? What? That would have been a draw had you not gotten knocked down. That's what they're saying? Yo, you outboxed him every round. Did you see the compu box? 50% to 30%. 50% to 40%. 59% I was out boxing the shit out of it. What? Is it because I was only using a jab? That's tough. That's tough. I want a rematch, man. Oliver Blowpart, I want a rematch, man. I can't. I can't. We're going to have to go into the loser bracket, but I can't rest knowing that. That this dude really got that over on me. Like, he's not that good. He wasn't even that good. That's the part that, like, blows me. Like, he wasn't even that good, man. Dude was just basic. He was average. That's crazy. That is legit crazy to me. That is legit crazy to me, man. That's one of those, that's, you know, boxing is, you know, boxing is the only sport where they'll just outright cheat you and not, you know? They just outright cheat you, right? Your, and we in America, so, you know. If we was in Japan, we probably would have got, we probably would have got that, but I don't, I don't know. You know how America is. That was a su that was suspect, bro. That was suspect. Edward Felder Felderman. That was wow. Um, it depends. Yeah, you could, but you would have to um, you would have to make the the year a little bit later. So you would have to start your career later in the year, so that way the heavyweight ranks could open up. But that's what I would suggest because that's going to give you the uh, the highest skill points right off rip. I can show you my guy Pierce Morgan so you can see. He looks like an absolute fucking animal. That's what I'll do. I'll show you Pierce Morgan and then we could call it there. I'll show you what a heavyweight, what a heavyweight monster looks like. So you can see that I'm not just all talk when I say that I, you know, I, I, we can really make, make things happen. We can make dreams come true. 
If you want to be a world champ, we can make it happen. This dude, this dude look like Dr. Robotnik. This dude is too tall and upright, like I can't really get my hooks off on him. Here we go. Put him in that corner, baby. Put him in that corner. Give him that front foot pressure. Oh, he hurt you with that jab a little bit. I seen it. I seen you flinch. I seen you flinch. You working that body? Oh my goodness. See, this is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. Like, you can't. Even when you think you got him against the robes, you whipping his ass. Drop you. I'm still, I'm not going to lie, I'm still kind of thinking about the, the Oliver fight. You know what I'm saying? I, I really feel like we, we won that fight. And taking that fight into this fight is kind of, kind of make me not really focus right now. As much as I should be for this opponent, because this opponent is really good. That shit, that's pissing me off. But yeah, if you make a, if you, um... Like I said, you would have to uh, make your character start later in the later in the timeline, so that way heavyweight is opened up, and you have to make sure that you eat a lot, high in proteins, uh, amino acids, amino acids, and um, not too high, maybe like 5,400, and you even out your uh, speed, strength, and uh, the other one, and you're good. To gain weight rather fast and make sure that you fight and climb through the ranks while fighting, you know. Don't chase him. Don't chase him. Don't chase him. That was a good round. 40%. See, this is the shit. This is the shit. They're going to be like, oh, you fucking. Just keep making a miss, man. You you got it. It's all right. I see it. Being that we in America, they're going to try to rob you. So Good to know. Good to know that we in America for real. Good to know we in America for real. And you can actually get robbed. All right, we gotta we gotta think about this dude. This dude is actually really good. You can't can't keep thinking about being robbed by at, at knife point in the subway. How a nigga that robbed us in the subway at knife point. Like this was South London or some shit. Oh my gosh. Like, am I not beating his ass? Excuse me? That's my fault. For, for me, you know what I'm saying? Fighting this dude like an idiot. I'm pressuring him. I'm getting hit with a lot of shots. I'm not, not counter punching. I'm just thinking that I could just walk right through him, and that's not the case at all. We got a lot of rounds to go. That was a better percentage. 48 is a lot better. 28, even though we got a knockdown. We just have to keep that up. Nigga did all that to change the camera. Fucking sucker.
<laughs> Got him. Psych. Psych. So all I, I want to know is am I not beating his ass right now? I'm hitting and not getting hit. Like I'm doing boxing 101. Kind of confused on how I lose these fights or how I'm even getting knocked down. Forty four percent. How is that forty four percent? How is that forty four percent? Explain that to me. How is that forty four percent? All right, maybe I'm missing a little bit more of my jabs than I think, but this is ridiculous, bro. The black and knees kid come over and he just get robbed. That's how we gonna do it. Like how we gonna play? Let the black and these kid come over and he get robbed right off rip. We already got American fighters that we're interested in. We don't need you coming from Japan and climbing into our ranks. Like, where, what happened to you? I thought you had power. Either you got power or he got a chin. Like, I don't know what. I done seen dudes with the best chins be get knocked out. Show me something. Show me Shit. I'm trying to I'm I'm you got me focused right now. This dude got me hella on my on the edge of my seat right now because I really feel like they cheating me. I really feel like they cheating me. He was doing good. I, I had some boxing strategy and then out of nowhere, you know, that just that last fight kind of left a bad taste in my mouth. And then this dude Whipping his ass, but they saying my percentages is off, and then I'm getting dropped. 
I don't know. It, 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 you know, it's, it's cheating shit like this in boxing. It just make you be like, bro, you know, what, what, what is the point of this? If we already got a, and it's the last round, we might as well go for the for the gust. Oh no, you got hurt a couple times. You got hurt a couple times. Back out of there. Yeah, I heard a couple times. Back out of there. Woo! Oh, there you go. Good hook. Oh. That's a loss in my book. This was a bad tournament. I ain't gonna lie. This is a really bad tournament. <sighs> you still got a lot of work to do, man. You still got a lot of work to do, man. You close. You close. You you made it to the uh You know what I'm saying? You made it to the finals, but you know. I don't know. I don't know what it is that still needs... Well, speed, obviously, is what, what needs to be worked on. But uh, your life is good. Your endurance is good. Concentration is all right. Twist body is all right. But I don't... Still, you still got a lot of work to do, man. It was supposed to be an easy-peasy tournament. I'm not going to lie. That's why I called it the easy work tournament. But it ended up not being as easy work as we thought. Um, let's take a look at the heavyweight, uh, Piers Morgan that we got on the squad, that we got in the gym, and, uh, I think we may call it there. Now, this is what a motherfucking champ looks like, okay? Look at that body. Do you see that body? That is the body of a champion, of a champion. That is a motherfucking champion's body. Ooh wee. Yeah, baby. 67 fights, 62 wins, 5 losses. And 60 wins by knockout. That boy, you don't want to I'm telling you. I'm telling you. You don't want to you don't want to get busy with that man. Let's change his feats. How? I'm gonna show you how. Let me show you how. Ah, uh, we can work with the Yuba shorts. I'm gonna show you how, son. By as soon as you make your character, like I said, eat. My man got forty billion dollars. Forty-one billion dollars or forty-one billion yens. So. That's like $8 million. That's not a lot. Look, this is the fools right here, bro. I'm not eating nothing. Eating like, well, we already we already diesel, but what, like I said, you just want to put your, um, your amino acids up, put your water up, glucose up, and make sure that this is even, man. Make sure that's even. I have um, a doctor and trainer because, you know, we got a really good doctor. We got a really good trainer. Where is he? This is our doctor. He costs 240 yen per fight. He ain't cheap. We got a, 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 a new trainer as well. My man costs 210 yen per fight. And I forgot what he specialized. Different trainers and different doctors specialize in different things. Same thing with your cut, man. We got the... The original cut man you know we, we we stay loyal to the soil over here all right yeah let me show you my dude let me show you my dude man diesel man cock weasel diesel you want to talk about cock weasel diesel okay when you look at the wbo who got the wbo belt piers morgan got the wbo belt we not they don't want to rank us in the in the. We're gonna be ranked in the um in the in the IBF, but I ain't, we ain't worried about it. 
The WBC. Who got the WBC belt? We got the motherfucking WBC belt. Who got the motherfucking uh, WBA belt? We got the WBA. We gonna have to fight uh, this dude, Tiger, I think. Oh no, we gotta fight Cannon actually. Mustafa Cannon from from Ghana, and that's gonna help us be able to fight this nigga from Guyana, even though it doesn't make any sense, but. Trust me, I've done this before. But yeah, man. You keep coming to the gym, you know what I'm saying? And you, you know, you should keep showing me what the things that you're working on. And uh, I can help you out. You see, man, we one belt away from being undisputed. We don't play no games over here. We don't play no games over here. And look, hold on, hold on. We Just to show you. Just to show you we don't play no games. 35 years old, we getting up there. How how much how much he weigh? 270, 270, 278, you know. Nothing crazy. Like around Tyson Fury weight. WBS heavyweight champion with 13 title defenses. Okay? WBA heavyweight champion with 12 title defenses. We just got the OEBA on our last video. Um, I don't think that I, I don't think I posted it on this channel, but, uh, we just got the WBO, the last fight. That shit was easy work and we working on the IBF and then we're going to be undefeated, man. I mean, we're going to be undisputed dogs. Frank Mackey. That's what we got it from. Second round knockout. Whipped his ass. Whipped his ass. Should have been there. And, you know, we was just defending the title, TKOs, and this dude, he had to throw in the towel. He was whipping his ass so bad. But, yeah, man. We don't, we don't play no games around here, man. We don't play no games. All right, all right, I got you, I got you. Give you one more. Give you one more before I hit the road. We ain't gonna do Pierce. Pierce got it. Pierce is getting in training camp. He getting ready for his uh his next fight. See who we gonna use. See who we gonna use. Um. Yeah, we might as well just fucking, we might as well just use, uh, use my boy Gary. Keep working on his career. See what's going to happen with that. Let me, um, hold on. Let me go grab something. I'll be right back. My boy Gary G. The fight of the night. I'm gonna end this on a on a high note. I'm gonna end this on a high note. Make sure that we actually get our shit right. We don't need no excuses. We don't need no excuses. We want world champions through here, man. It may take a while, you know. Pierce Morgan, he a champion, and he got a lot of he got losses on his record, man. So, don't be ashamed. Do not be ashamed, man. It comes with the territory if you're trying to be great. It comes with the territory if you're trying to be great, man. Not rank nowhere. I mean, I keep forgetting we are we are fucking six round boxer, but still, you know. 
Who are we gonna fight? This should be a good fight. It should be a e this should be easy work. You know what I'm saying get you a nice little tune up or something. Put in 90 days out. Little Tokyo gym. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Go back. Oh, oh. Wait a minute. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Little Tokyo final. Oh, this is the only gyms that we can fight at. Little Tokyo. All right. That's fine. Got to keep working on that speed, man. That's all we need. What? What happened? Why are you yelling? He always yelling for no reason. I literally don't understand why Coach be yelling. He just be like, he's like, God damn it. Just do what I tell you to do. I'm like, I'm doing. What the? What, what do you want me to do? Literally, what do you want me to do? I, I have no idea what you want. what you want from me right now. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. What the fuck is going on with the speed right now? Why does it keep going down? Yeah, I, I understand. I feel I, 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 I'm going to get you happy you're in good shape right now, but I'm kind of kind of peeved that, you know what I'm saying? There we go. There we go. I think we could I think we could use a little bit more. A little bit more proteins. Fuck it. We didn't get what we wanted to be. I would like him to have been like at least a 180 with the uh, with the dash speed and all, but you know, not the end of the world. The body's looking good. Twist body's looking good. Bad health and fatigue is what we wanted to be. Life is all right, but you know, we can we can always work on these things. We can always work on these things. Stephen James. These American names are so stupid. Four, two, and one. One knockout, so he's not really a knockout artist. You don't gotta really worry about it. Little peekaboo guy. It should be easy work, man. It's, I'm telling you, it should be easy work. Good way to end the night. Good night, Cap. Still 19, still young, man. You still got a lot of work to do on your career. Round one. No, a couple losses don't define you. You got one of the jib. Oh my god, look at that. Look at this. Look at this. This is easy work, bro. This is easy work. This is gonna be easy work. Keep him at the end of that jab. Look, he wants to he wants to do that in and out herky jerky shit. He ain't gonna be able to do that with us. Not with us. You your hand speed way too quick, bro. Your hand be way too quick, bro. He ain't gonna be able to do none of that shit with us. We may get two fights in. I ain't gonna lie. Depending on how fast this is, we may as well get two fights in. One, two. 
Use a special punch on that dude. We're gonna hit him with another special. We're gonna hit him with another special punch. Oh! Knockout! We'll get one more. We'll get one more. Cause I need I need your uh we need that speed where we want it to be. Cause that, that shit was just too easy, man. That shit was just too easy, bruh. What does the purple mean? I forgot what the purple means. Oh, and purple means he's busy, I guess. That nigga's a problem. That, that purple means he's ducking us in all honesty. Hell no. Nah. Nah. I like Arthur. I like Arthur for you. It's a good fight for your career. You gotta pick the right guys, man, to make you, you know, get your confidence up. A lot of tough fights in a row, you know, you make you make your confidence start to start to uh, start to wary, and then you start thinking to yourself, like, damn, do I really want to do this? Is is this like? Like a career that I want to do for real, you know what I'm saying? So, you always want to give your fighter a couple of guys that make them think. Sway speed is getting up there. Footwork could be a little bit better, but you know. Looking good, looking good. Fatigue and bad health, all right? Let's actually lower that a little bit. Let's not, we don't want to work out, you know? We don't need too much working out. I want to make sure you're in shape, but, you know? You want to be in shape, but you don't want to be drawn out and exhausted. Everything is looking good. Life is looking good. Sway speed was up though. That's the thing. We can actually. I can give you some more protein, man. No, honestly. See if we could get protein back up. Nah, not gonna be able to do it. Not gonna be able to do it, blood. Yeah, we wasn't able to do it. Next fight, we should be able to get your sway speed up. Looking good, looking good. May weight easy, S easy. You know the nutrition is on point. The boxing skills is on point. We work. We we doing a good job. We doing a good job. Like I said, we we could be better. We could work on a couple more things, but I'm not concerned. I'm not concerned. I still think that you could be a world champion someday. Undisputed and, you know, all those other things and stuff like that. Nah, that's, that's you know, to be seen. But uh, for the most part, you, you're going to be a good guy, you know. You'll definitely be a dangerous guy. Nine wins, three losses, you know, nine knockouts. You're a knockout artist, so they know that about you, you know. We're giving you some good guys to, so that way your record is good. So we move in your career the way we want to nice and not slow, not too slow. So that way, you know, dudes don't think that you're not worth a damn, but not too fast to where you're getting exposed either. That dude got power. I could tell. Your foot speed. You still got to work on your foot speed, bro. And that sway speed, we had it at, we had it high, but we had just sway speed high, and then what happened? Whoop. 
Stop doing don't. Nope. 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 Keep hitting him with that hook. Keep hitting him with that hook. Stop standing toe to toe with him. Just because you think he, just because he's slow and stuff like that, don't mean that he don't got power. That's what that is. That shit is slowing you down too. I'm standing toe to toe with him, thinking that you're good. That hurt him. That jab definitely hurt him. Keep laying them track. Keep laying the tracks with the jab. Keep moving your feet. He can't close distance as fast as those other guys, so you can control distance really well. Even though your feet isn't isn't what we want it to be. It's a good fight. It's a good fight. It's a good fight. These are the fights that you need to, to make you remember certain things in your mechanics and stuff and your technique. These are the fights that you need to make you remember about your technique. 55% and how much did he land? 35% but according to them this is what this will be an even round. Fuck out of here. That shit got me tight. That shit got me hella tight, bro. I'm gonna talk about upset. My feet is actually good now. Don't stop getting hit. You get hit by them shits. He slows you down. Move good. You can move way faster than he can, even though your feet ain't the best. That slowed you down a little bit, but you're alright. Mm, keep hitting him with that Hamza. Stop getting hit with them shots, bro. I'm, I'm not going. I'm not going to keep telling you again because you're going to end up getting knocked down. I know this shit seems like this is easy, like you, like this is gonna be an easy work fight. I told you, you can't think anything is easy work. Beautiful work. Easy work. Easy work. Don't get hurt. Easy work, bro. It's easy work. speed is something faster than he's ever seen in his life. He ain't never seen hands that fast. I promise you, that jab is blazing speed. The jab is blazing. Blazing hip-hop and R&B. Beautiful, beautiful setup. Beautiful setup. Walked him right into that special hook. All right, my guy. You're going to get this win, too. You're going to get this win. I got you. Make sure you come back to the gym, man. 
You're gonna have your world champion in no time. Beautiful round. You gotta give him some salt or something. You gotta put some, some shit on him, bro. Ooh. Oh shit. Telling you. Telling you. Just because you got him and you think you beating his ass, that don't mean anything. That just means that you get that you set yourself up for something, man. That don't mean anything that but you setting yourself up for failure. Tough. I'm not getting no ice on my back. I'm not getting nothing. Seen that setup? Oh, he's hurt. Boys on the verge of going. He is on the verge of going. Mm. Crunched him. Crunched him with the uppercut.
Oh shit. We're hurt. Oh shit. Oh shit. Do we win this fight or do we lose? We won. And a shocker. See, I told you that first round. You said, oh, that first round, we lost. How? We beat the dog shit out of him in that first round. That's what I'm saying. This America shit, bro. This shit is, this shit is rigged, bro. This shit is really rigged, man. You get to see it live, bro. We're going to save it here. We're going to leave it here. But they, they did us dirty a couple of times. But, you know, that's not going to stop us from being a world champ. Ain't, ain't shit going to stop us, man. We too, we too star-studded, man. And if you don't believe it, F 